how to achieve great business results. In one of our videos, we explained the five dysfunctions of a business relationship. These were trust, conflict, lack of commitment, accountability, and attention to results. Now, today I'm not going to explain them again. You can watch one of our videos more in detail what it all means. But I want to explain today how you can put this into practice in your organization. And firstly, I want to start with, some of, uh, with two observations. First of all, we see that companies are very good at installing a fair amount of trust. This base part of the pyramid is not the problem. On the other side, on the top side of the, uh, of the pyramid, that's not a problem at all. Companies are great at defining clear KPIs and objectives. Maybe they're a little bit uh, all over the place in the organization and you might centralize them making use of a uh, business intelligence tool like Power, uh, like Power BI, but that's not a problem. The biggest challenge is this middle part and that's where BRM comes into place. How can you put this middle part into practice? You can make use of three building blocks. First of all, make sure there is a clear plan. A plan is only a plan if you don't define the responsibilities, who is going to execute that plan. And that's what we call the collaboration part. Once you have these two involved, you already have the good base, you have defined your road to results. Now, during that road, the plan might change. So, it is important to make sure that that plan doesn't get stuck in a drawer, in a PowerPoint or an Excel sheet. So, define the rhythm Define a cycle where you want to modify and to follow up on that plan. That's the third part, the following up part. So, putting into practice BRM means making sure there's a plan, collaborating and defining key responsibilities and key responsibles and defining a rhythm to follow up. As simple as that, but it's, easily, uh, it's more easy to say than to, uh, to realize. If you like what you've seen, make sure to give us, give us a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and take care.